All right, today we're going to install the Zigbee gateway from Solar Edge. This is a version two home gateway and plug-in kit for North America. This is what's in the box. And we are going to go ahead and install this. So the first thing we gotta do, uh, well, the first thing you need to do is you need to power down. So you gotta make sure this is turned off and you gotta make sure that this button over here on the side is turned off. It's a little red switch and you want it turned to zero to turn it off. And then we gotta remove both of these panels. So we're gonna remove both of these panels. I've already loosened up the screws. So we're gonna take that away and we're gonna take that away. So the next thing we need to do uh, after you have waited for like five minutes for the DC power to power down after you've turned the red switch off and disconnects off everything's off you're gonna take the Zigbee gateway uh, itself and we're going to install it on the motherboard here so basically it just has small plug-ins you just got to be careful and make sure you're plugging it in to the right spot and it is actually kind of hard to see it without a flashlight so we're gonna put a little light on the situation and we got it there we got it there we got it there we got it there all right so there's our gateway installed next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take the antenna get this tape off of it here this cable untwisted here and it basically says to drop this down in between the fins just route it down through there and let it come out the bottom like that then we're just gonna take this and attach it to one of the fins by just pushing down on it like that all right, then we're gonna bring this around. We gotta take this off. And one of these small plugs comes out. Maybe they all three come out, I'm not sure. Ah, the whole thing comes out. All right, so the whole thing comes out. And then we're gonna pull that plug out because that's the hole we need. It's just a little, well, Got it stuck in the box. It's a little small piece like that that we're gonna pull out of that plug. All right. And if you notice that it comes apart, now we're gonna take this. Gotta put the nut on, and then. We'll put this on. Okay, like that. Put that up through there. this through that hole up through there and bring it around I like to try to keep it away from those power lines if I can don't know that I can let's see if we can run it let's see if we can just do it like that Take a tie strip. All 
I'm gonna put this tie strap on here to keep it from being all over that power wire there. That looks pretty good, I like it. All right, so we've turned on our solar edge. We've turned on our disconnect. We're gonna turn this on. All right, so we have opened our set app for solar edge and we have communication being established. We're going to scan the QR code. We're going to move the inverter to the piece and then release within two seconds. Continue. We're going to join. Wi-Fi connected. Continue. Device is activated. We're going to start commissioning. Okay. Communication is what we need to do. We need to make sure that Zigbee's turned on. Just looking for the master. And it's not plugged in. So let's go plug that in right quick. This is our brand new meter from duke i don't see anywhere on it saying net i thought it would say net on it somewhere but it doesn't it just says 4g cellular but basically the guy came out this morning and put this in and said there's going to be four different readings all we got to do is pay attention to one and two so this is the first time i've actually even looked at it There's three. There's four. There's net. That's some net metering right there. I have no idea what our E9 is. Well, that's a bunch of eight. Don't have a clue. And there's number one, so I don't know what six kilowatt hours. I don't know if that's consumption or production. I have no idea. And nothing on number two. And I know we're not producing a whole lot right now because we're just bringing it on, and uh, and it's a crappy day, so. You can see we're not producing a whole lot because we got nothing but clouds right now, but we are producing 260 watts. We we'll go over here and we look. It's not there. Oh, it's there finally. Hey, we'll copy that password that we put in there. We're going to join it. It connected. We're going to go back. Join Wi-Fi connected continue Device activated start commissioning All right, so status. Hey, we got a SOK, Zigbee Slave. We're connected to the Zigbee.
here we are laying out the pattern for the end panels on the Equilibrium Ecofoot 2 Plus base mounts. Greenwood County wants me to cap off the ends. So what we ended up doing is we made a cardboard template. Kind of got an idea of what size it needed to be. We've got the Milwaukee shear. And basically what we're doing, if you see right over there on that wooden platform, we've already cut out four over there. We test cut one, and then we take it down to the brake on the lower part of the shop down there. We break them and then we're using ground clips to clip them onto the underside of the panel and to the uh, wind deflector on the back side of the panels.